Hi guys, welcome back. Um, <laughs> I never know how to like, uh, how to open up here because, not open up like my heart, but open up the video because, yeah, I just, I don't know what to say. I guess that's why a lot of YouTubers say, hi, welcome back to my channel. Um, because I have, I have no idea what to say other than having like a catchphrase or something. So hi and welcome. Um, my name is Angel, if you don't already know. Um, it has been a couple of weeks since I last posted a video of a cover, um, and about a month, I think, since I last posted a chatty video. So welcome back to my chatty videos. Um, I have spent the last month posting just about every week. So I actually did it. I posted a video every week. There might have been a week where I, like, accidentally skipped towards the end, but then I posted it the following. So approximately i've posted every single week um it started with adore you by harry styles um followed by um favorite crime by olivia rodrigo third was defender by rita springer and fourth was um daydreaming by paramore so i got four <laughs> videos out which now that i say it i'm like okay i did it i did one month but then the last two weeks i haven't put something out um, part of the reason I haven't is because, one, um, I had, like, a few gigantic pimples on my face, and I didn't want to record with that as, um, I don't know if that comes across as vain or insecure or some mix of both, um, but that made me feel like I didn't want to, like, record and have that. But I also didn't know what song to do, um, and I also was kind of, um, like, just a little bit in a rut. Um, in my mind and in my heart and then also like some grief too so I didn't I wasn't really in a place where I wanted to um, create or I did but didn't it's some sort of like mixed conglomeration um, yeah anyways I want to talk about like what I've learned since posting consistently for a month I don't I feel like that's like not enough to be like this is what I've learned but alas you can not alas you can learn um, stuff by doing it um, consistently for a month um, it was hard work, um, but I'm glad I did it because I've definitely learned since instead of, I've definitely learned that instead of like being insecure about, um, or worried about what, what you're trying to do, if you just step out and do it, you're going to learn and get better over time. Um, just kind of like being in school, you're learning long division for the first time. Yeah, doing the first time may be a little tricky, but then as you keep doing it, you're going to keep getting better. Is my teacher showing yet? <laughs> um, okay, first video, and keep in mind as I've like posted these videos, it's been my first time recording myself with my professional camera. Um, I have a Fujifilm X-T20, um, and yeah, the first time I recorded with that was back um, in Arizona, and Jonas, my husband, um, was the one who set it up and recorded it for me, but this time I had to record it by myself, and there's like lighting things you have to think about, there's recording time, um, positioning the camera in the right way, um, the fact that like me being brown, like if there was a bright background, I would have to think about how to adjust the lighting that way so that when I come into the frame that I don't look just like a silhouette. Um, so technical stuff, um, but I'm going to go through like what I learned by each, um, with each uh, video I did. So there's four of them, okay? Are you ready? Um, so the first one was Adore You by Harry Styles. Ugh, I feel so cringy about that uh, video because I love that song and I feel like I did not do it justice. I'm like partially tempted to redo it again and do it better. Um, but that was definitely like the first video of me recording myself um, and uh, with the camera and doing it. Um, but... That, that was just like, that was the initial first step of, okay, learning everything new. Um, the lighting was definitely off, so I looked so dark. And then as the, as the um, sun was setting, like the light, it, it was getting worse. So I had to like edit um, a little bit in post, not using a professional um, program, but to make it a little lighter. Um, my outfit it wasn't really that comfortable so if you use an outfit that isn't really comfortable it kind of shows um i've noticed that 
uh, with myself and photos, so it definitely comes across in video too. Um, and then, yeah, I think that one was just like the first step of like getting it out there, um, doing the basics. I also was like rushing as I was, uh, uh, what do you call it? As I was rehearsing and like taking takes for making, <laughs> I'm sorry, my words escaped me today. Um, recording takes for that because it was my turn to cook dinner. And so, um, I totally did not, um, I was like, I really have to get this recording right so that I can cook dinner because it's my turn to cook dinner and it's already late and the sun's going down. Um, so that was in my head as I was recording. So all of that like comes out in um, in your uh, performance, I think. Um, anyways, did that and then learned how to upload it and post it. But because I wasn't really super proud of the outcome, I didn't even like, I, with each of my videos, I've been like putting out like the video and then putting out a reel or a short um, or a TikTok. So those are like short form videos, the ones that are uh, like portrait. Um, and I didn't with that one, I didn't try to like post little sneak peeks of it because I'm not super proud of it, but um, it was it was that first step that I needed. So I'm grateful for that experience. I'm like partially tempted to remove it off of YouTube and like redo it because I want to do it justice. So that was the first one, Adore You. Um, the second one, Favorite Crime. Um, I recorded, I did it differently. Oh, this is this also mixes in with the first one. Um, I different, did it differently. I recorded a different spot. Um, I recorded when the lighting was better, um, when nobody was home, um, and I was standing with my guitar, um, which I feel is way more comfortable than sitting and feeling so stiff. Um, for me, was um, standing and moving, and I felt way more comfortable, way more... Um, in my shoes, ironically, I wasn't wearing shoes during <laughs> the recording, um, but yeah, and uh, Jonas reminded me, like, just have fun with it, um, and I had to remind myself to just have fun with it and enjoy it and be like, I love this song, um, I enjoy it, and I want that to come across, so that, for that video, I was um, proud of that one. I think that was the first video that I was like, yes, I recorded it well, and I'm proud of it, and it, again, like, it doesn't have, it's not, like, perfect but it was I got what I wanted I had fun with it um I liked how I looked I was wearing an outfit that I enjoyed um I got to move and not feel so stiff so I was really proud of that one um and from that one it's like have fun with it wear comfortable clothes um and yeah mostly just enjoy it and it it's easier when you enjoy it and better for you and I think for whoever watches after um, the third one was Defender by Rita Springer. It was the first one that I did. Um, it's not my first ever worship song that I've recorded and put out. Um, my first YouTube videos I posted, it's not because I wanted to, but um, for auditioning for a program for my college. Um, so I had to put out two audition videos there. Um, but this time it was of my own volition. Um, I recorded a song that I love that meant... Um, a lot to me and that has moved me um but it's a little strange um for those of you who are believers or even like worship leaders for me i'm trying to figure out like recording myself doing a worship song um for the lord but also like in a way that other people can see because when it's just me and god like it's just me and god and i don't have to think about like video it's just me and him and my tears and mistakes and um, whatever else is included, but recording it is different. I'm still, I could do a whole video on my thoughts on that, and I would love to have conversation with people about that, but, um, like, I know, when I record that, I don't want it to be, like, ooh, look at me, here's my performance, because it's for the Lord, but as believers, is isn't everything for the Lord, um, so, yeah, um, so then, like, getting compliments on that video, too, is, like, I want to say thank you, but I like, don't because, like, like thank you for your compliment, but also like this is for the Lord. I don't know. Um, I hope that didn't come across in a negative way. I'm super um, grateful when people are um, giving compliments or it blesses them. Like it blesses me to hear that it blesses other people. Um, but I'm just I feel weird. Like I don't know. It's just a weird thing. I don't, you know, I don't have all my thoughts figured out on that, so I don't know if I can, um, can you speak on it, but, um, yeah, I want to, I want to do it right and do it for the Lord. I don't know how to receive compliments when it comes to certain 
uh, like worship videos. Still figure out my thoughts on that. Let me know like on anything that I'm saying, your thoughts, because um, I would love for um, my uh, like my videos to be a place of conversation too um, and to hear from you guys. So it's not just like me speaking, but I, I like genuinely would love to hear from you guys too. Um, so tell me your thoughts on that. I don't know if I spoke what I thought well, but I would love to hear what you say and like continue conversation. Anyways, um, but I, I love that song Defender by Rita Springer and it's so, it's a, it's so special. And if you haven't heard her version, I recommend for you to hear her original version. It's beautiful. Um, and then the last song I did was Daydreaming by Paramore, um, which was such a fun song. Um, I, I, um, learned it in junior high and definitely like, uh, blasted her music in junior high and sang all of the Paramore songs. Um, but that one was super fun. Oh my gosh, I had such an interesting time. I could, and probably, I still have the other takes, but um, oh my gosh, such a frustrating time trying to record because there were these two, two gigantic flies just buzzing around and you they were so big, you could see them in the video. They were so loud and complaining and I would just try to record and they would just buzz like around me on purpose. And earlier that day, I was in the, on the other side of the house like watching tv and eating and they were there and they were just just flies that's why that's why when people are annoying they compare people to flies because that was so annoying um and so i don't think i got like a perfect take on that what takes are perfect but i don't think i got the full take that i wanted but i still was like mostly happy with what i posted and i liked my outfit too um can you tell i enjoy fashion and aesthetics um but yeah, the, I, there was a point when in one of the takes where I was trying to like totally kill the flies and I was unsuccessful. Um, I was not using the right tool. I tried to use like one of my sister's books that she got in the mail. <laughs> Don't worry, it wasn't a book that she wanted. Um, but uh, <laughs> anyways, that was the time. Um, one thing I found interesting with that is that, that um, the Paramore, Daydreaming by Paramore, the video didn't really get a lot of views at least thus far, but then the reel I posted, or slash the short for like YouTube, um, got more view way more views. So um, it's interesting what people will be more drawn to, the longer form or the shorter form. Um, but yeah, so far, um, Defender by Rita Springer has gotten the most views for the last four that I've posted. Um, I just posted a poll on um, YouTube um, asking people what their favorite cover was out of all of those. So, um, if you haven't already, um, picked one, let me know. Um, it would be fun to see, um, what you guys are liking. And that also helps me figure out, um, like how I can better provide content for you guys that you like. Um, anyways, those are things that I've learned from, um, my last four videos that I've posted on YouTube. Um, I'm, I'm thinking if I want to add more to what I'm saying here, but this video is already 13 minutes. Um, but yeah, um, I guess I will real quick just to, to finish up, um, moving forward. Um, uh, I definitely still want to be consistent. Um, but I think I'm like, I do, I want to do my best and keep improving as I keep going. Um, which I, looking back, I can acknowledge that I, I have. Um, been improving as I've kept going but I one of my faults is sometimes I can try too hard um, not to sound like Michael Scott of like I try too hard I I do too much but like I do it to the point of a fault and I want um, like for example I'll watch other people's videos of them singing and doing what they love and you could just feel the passion and be inspired that way I don't know if that's the way people feel like when they watch my videos, um, but I definitely want to come across, or, or not come across, I want to be myself. Um, but I guess that's what I want. I want to be more of myself and not try too hard to get everything right, um, but to let myself be a little more free and a little more natural. Um, so I think recording, can you hear the cars on the street? Um, <laughs> um, I think then for the next few videos, um, might just record with my iPhone. So that way I can focus more on the music. 
Um, I mean, maybe I'll still record with my, um, with my Fujifilm, I don't know. Um, but I don't want to worry as much about getting it right, but just loving what I'm singing and hopefully that um, comes through, through um, the videos too. Um, yeah, well, thank you for watching. If you've watched this far, you've gotten through the 15 minutes and I, I really appreciate um, you either watching my channel or wherever you're watching um, this video. I might post it on um, Instagram as well. Um, but yeah, thank you so much. If there is something that um, caught your attention, um, one of the comments, feel free to comment below and let me know what you found interesting, um, things that you've learned through um, posting things, or maybe something that you've learned in the last week. I don't know. I, I would love to hear from you though and um, have a conversation on my channel. Um, or again, I post this on Instagram too. So, um, and any of the posts, I love hearing from you guys genuinely. Um, but yeah, and then let me know if there are certain songs that you want me to cover, certain artists. Um, I am, uh, like I have a list in my head of certain songs that I want to cover, some that I want to have, like Jonas, my husband, or Anika, my sister, um, do duets with me for. So I'm, I'm, I'm thinking. And, um, Q&As too. I have, um, some questions that I'm planning to do a Q&A video soon. So feel free to leave those below and I hope you have an awesome day and that if it's not awesome, I am sending you, um, a virtual hug from me to you. So yeah, I hope you have a good day and I will talk to you later. Thanks for watching. Bye.